I'll pick you up after school for dialysis. And don't forget, mm. monitor my water intake. You sure you're gonna be okay? You've had a lot to digest. I just heard back from the Ministry of Records. And? I got some exciting news. You found your birth parents? Yeah, my birth father withheld his name, but I found my birth mother and she lives nearby, so. Wow. That's good. Her name's Dawn. So I'm gonna call her this morning. Mom, I kind of feel weird about this, like I'm cheating on you or something. I can't imagine what you must be going through. I'll be fine. Honestly. As weird as it is finding out I'm adopted, there's a silver lining because I might get my kidney right. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Holly J. Just remember, we don't know anything about this person. Be careful. Keep my eyes open, Mom. Tugging at your shirt, you'll stretch it out of shape, Adam. It feels tight. I think all my shirts are too tight. <laughs> I can take a hint. You want to go shopping? No, it's not about the shirts. It's what lies underneath. Stop being cryptic. I was hoping we could talk some more about chest reconstruction. Ah. <sighs> you know how I feel about surgery. Which is why I'm bringing it up again. And I respect that you feel like a boy. I don't feel like a boy, I am. You're 15, okay? Your body is still changing. And we're talking about removing parts of you. You make it sound so horrible. I'll make a deal with you. We'll speak to your counselor about this. Really? So if she okays me for surgery, then we'll have some decisions to make. Okay. Cool. cool. It's ringing. Oh my God, what if I get voicemail? What do I say? Hi, this is your birth daughter. May I have your kidney? Hello? Hi, Dawn? I'm Holly J. Uh, Holly J. Sinclair. No, wait, uh, no, I'm not trying to sell you anything. I actually called to ask you something. Did you put a baby up for adoption in 1994? I know it's a private question. Um, I have a good reason to ask. That baby is... That's me. Yeah, I, I just found your info online. I thought we could meet up. Great. Great, yeah, um, there's this place called The Dot. After school, maybe four. Okay, I'll see you there. Yeah, bye, Don. <sighs> I'm meeting my birth mom for coffee? Holy J, that is so awesome. Those hopefuls who auditioned, the roles are now posted on the board. Yes, I'm going to be clear. Thank you so much, Eli. You deserved it. You were awesome. You can get off me now. Eli, we don't have to pretend. I know I'm your leading lady, both on stage and in your heart. 
Imogen, we're not together. <laughs> but yesterday, you kissed me back. I'm flattered, but I'm not in the right place, emotionally speaking. Where are you, emotionally speaking? Well, I'm off my meds, so my emotions are a moving target. And I'm just starting to feel a little better getting over Claire and such. I don't want to mess with that. You understand. Congrats, Imogen. I can't believe Ryan Lynch talked to me for so long. What did he write in your book? To Katie, don't give up on your dreams and they won't give up on you. I told him about my dream of becoming a journalist. That's my dream. I'm serious. I'm, I'm hoping to be a radio journalism major. Really? Well, you do have quite a presence on air. We could go to the same university, study together. It'd be awesome. Are you always this enthusiastic? <laughs> Just happy, I guess. I'm, I'm having a fun time with you. I like you. I like you, too. It's just... Yeah, I, I know. I, just so you know, I'm gonna be making some changes. Really? What kind of changes? You know, physical stuff. Sure. Whatever you need to do. Hey, uh, I'm starving. You wanna grab poutine? Fries, gravy, and cheese? Thought you'd never ask. I bet she gave you up to pursue this brilliant career, made big money, conquer the business world. Look, it's gonna be trippy, but don't forget why we're here, okay? Let's do this. Where is she? No. 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 There she is. Hi. Excuse me, I'm Holly J. Do I know you? Holly J? It's me, Dawn. You, you must have missed me sitting over here with my kids. I guess I did. Claire! Don't do that. Sorry. Just really wanted to thank you. You got the part. And I got the boy. Really? Without you, there'd be no me and Eli. Well, I'm glad it worked out. Me too. Me too. So, as a token of my eternal appreciation, dinner for two at that steak place, thought you could take your boyfriend out on a date. Really? Wow, that's so nice, Imogen. Jake's a steak guy. I thought so. You know what? I'll call him. See if he's free tonight. Excellent. It was my first year of university when my boyfriend, your father, I guess, heard about my situation. Never heard from him again. By the time that I, I, I knew that I was pregnant, I, I had two choices. Drop out, raise a baby, or give up the baby, stay in university, and get a career. It wasn't easy. It took me nearly a year to decide to give you up. For the record, I don't blame you. <laughs> you know, Holly J is quite ambitious herself. She's going to Yale this year. Yale? That's amazing. I'm a Western alumni myself. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, what did you major in? Commerce. I work in the financial sector. I'm a senior accounts associate. <laughs> so you handle important accounts? Well, not so much these days. I'm really just a glorified bank teller. But the hours are flex, and, and being a single mom, that's, that's golden. <laughs> so, Holly J, I'm sure Dom would love to hear more about you. Yes, please. Well, um, I already mentioned Yale. Um, I graduate high school soon, so I'm stoked about that. And, um... Holly J has something important to ask you. Now, were your wisdom teeth impacted? Mine were fine. Is that all? No, my dentist thinks mine might be, so, uh, just wanted to know my history. Anyway, it was really good meeting you, but I think I should go. OK. 
Come on, Fiona, we're gonna be late. Yeah, I wouldn't want to waste valuable time, would we? So did I pass? It's not that kind of test. The question here is step one. There's so much more to cover before I can make a recommendation about surgery. Great. So what's step two? Well, generally, we recommend further counseling before starting hormone therapy. I don't need counseling. Honey, we just want to make sure. What if you change your mind? I won't. I just need to fix my chest so I won't freak out this girl. This is about a girl? No, that's not what I meant. Adam, your body's still changing. I just want to look like how I feel, and I can't because of these. Strapping them down all the time isn't working. People can tell. That I can help with. There are alternatives. Take a look. a loser. You're not a loser. You choked. So I guess it's finally starting to settle in. I guess I've always been more focused on where I'm going, but... Yeah. I want to get to know Dawn. There'll be time for all that once you ask her to get tested. What if I scare her off? What's more important? Having a relationship with your birth mom or getting healthy, going to Yale, living life. I got a feeling that shaken tree. I got a Thank you. Trust me, this is so much better than movie night with our parents. Hey, send your text you want to talk about Clara. Yeah, just some backstory type questions I wanted to hash out. You look fantastic, by the way. Cool. So, should we sit down? Um, can we go sit, like, back there? Uh, okay. I really should tell them eventually. Hey, Mom, I'm dating your boyfriend's son. <laughs> no, thanks. How about we try not to think about it? Oh, sorry. Didn't see you two lovebirds. <laughs> Awkward. Come on, Muffin, let's go sit. Eli, you know Jake? What a coincidence, huh, Imogen? Just trying to break the ice. How's it going? Let's go sit down, okay, Muffin? Stop calling me that. The real Claire Edwards would never do what you just did. We both know that's not true. The real Claire Edwards would do anything to get what she wants. Hey, Katie, last night was crazy fun, wasn't it? I was hoping for a repeat. Maybe we could go to a movie Friday? Yeah. Um, Adam, I think maybe you got the wrong idea. What idea is that? That I like you in that way. Oh, no. Katie, come on. You misunderstood. Ooh, back again, are we? You know me, I can't get enough dialysis. Any news today? I do have the results of your friend Fiona's blood tests. They're negative, I'm afraid. No, I'd never ask her to go through with it anyway. And there's something else. I'm looking at your latest tests. And, uh, we'd hope to really slow the process, but I'm gonna level with you. 
Your results are showing end-stage kidney failure. I know that's not the answer you wanted to hear. But uh, I put you on a transplant list. The typical wait time's about 12 months. Could be sooner. I'll be at Yale by then. You might consider deferring Yale. Hey, don't give up hope, okay? Quiet in there. Did you get the license plate of the guy that ran you over? <laughs> it was a girl. Katie? Ah, oh, sorry, man. I thought something was going on. Don't worry, we'll find you a new fine female. I don't know. Well, look, don't get all defeated on me, all right? Things will get easier with this new profile you got going on. You, uh, trying something new? Yeah, compression vest. Oh, sounds painful. Yeah, kind of. It's better than the binding I was using before. <laughs> well, look, I'm just saying that this new Debooting device works. Yeah, but will I ever be flat enough for the Katie's of the world? I, I don't have the answers, ma'am. Yeah, I know you've helped a lot already. I made you look at my chest. Yeah, please, never again. It's really confusing. For meeting me, especially in your lunch break. You, you said it was urgent. Yeah, um, well, here's the thing. I have a, a medical issue. Oh. Yeah, I've got a renal condition. So my kidneys are in, in stage failure. <laughs> what does it mean? It means I'm gonna need a transplant. Look, I know you have a ton on your plate, but I'm wondering if you'd think about getting tested just to see if you're a possible donor. I'm supporting two kids on my own. I know, I feel so rotten even asking. That's, that's why I couldn't last time. What's the recovery time? I don't exactly know, but my doctor can tell you everything you need to know. Well, I'll get tested, and uh, we'll take it from there. <laughs> Someone wants to see you. I owe you an apology. Don't worry. I'm okay. How are you? I'm good. I'm great. That's awesome. I'm so glad to see you in a better place now. Emotionally. Uh, I couldn't get more wood from the shop. Excellent. Jake's working on our sets. We need a carpenter. He wants an extra credit. Everybody's happy. So you moved on. You know, Imogen, seeing Jake as Claire made me realize something. What's that, Eli Goldsworthy? That I'm not over Claire at all. That's why I asked Jake for help. As the warrior poet Sun Tzu said, keep your friends close, enemies closer. is Don. Thank you, Don. This means a lot to our family. You've done more for Holly J than I ever could have. Yeah, results tomorrow. Fingers crossed. Yeah, fingers crossed. <laughs> hey, what's up, my friend? Quick, what's a good online name? For? I'm joining an FTM site. 
Oh, for hookups? Yeah, that's my man. Okay. No, it's to meet other trans guys. I'll get to chat with some dudes going through similar things. Whoa. Whew. That's intense. That's my life. That guy started out as a girl? Physically, yeah. And that's gonna be you someday? Someday. Cool. Does this mean I'm fired now? Shut <laughs> up, man. You're my friend, like it or not. Watch pot doesn't boil any faster. It doesn't boil any slower. She'll call you when she hears. I just feel like everything is at a standstill until I get the results. Oh my god, this is her. Dawn? Uh, thanks for calling. Yeah, I'm pretty desperate to hear the results. Yeah, more than you know. Oh my god, that is the best news! What? Uh... Okay, no, I... I get it. Yeah, of course. You have to do what you have to do. Okay, bye. So what, she's not gonna do it? No, she wants to do it. She wants to give me her kidney. <laughs> So what's the problem? She wants $20,000.